Hey, happy Saturday, y'all. Just wanted to pop in with a quick upload for today. Howard and I just came in from our not Friday, but Saturday uh, date night. Um, last night we were just kind of a little tired. So we decided to go out today after, of course, the freaking snow just kept going on and off, on and off all day long. It's just ridiculous how it just wouldn't, it wouldn't end. It just, so we're just like, okay, we got things to do. Let's go and do our thing. Let's get out there and let's oh, just run, run our run errands. Uh, I got a couple of things for my great niece's birthday. And um, we had a little something to eat since he wants to talk about me and my spirits. <laughs> yeah, we did that. Like I always say, the tiniest ones are the ones that like to feast, not the most, but you know, a lot as well. So yeah, I love to eat. Food is our friend. So um, I, we, yeah, we had a great meal this evening. We jumped over to Outback and partook of... I'm a lightweight, y'all. I'm not even halfway finish my drink. I still need to finish my food. My baby eating his food, doing a great job at it. <laughs> so, whew. wish me luck. Yeah, that tonight, <laughs> and I had me a little, I had me a little spirit. So. I'm like, yeah, I don't know. I don't, I don't know if y'all can tell, but yeah, I'm I'm really relaxed. And it was a strawberry mojito, and well, that was actually the very first time I had a. I think first time I had a strawberry mojito. Usually, uh, I'm, I mean, I've had a regular one, but that was not my favorite. I've had a pineapple. That was like super super good. So pineapple mojito is my favorite, but the strawberry one you know, is pretty good. Um, it was strong and I'm a lightweight. <laughs> so as soon as I started sipping, it was just like, okay. Um, yeah, I'm, 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 I need to just pump the brakes on this one because I, yeah, I wasn't doing too good. <laughs> I wasn't holding on too good with that one. So, um, so just wanted to jump on to say earlier I had posted a video on my Instagram about the I wish I had my camera going about um, driving the, you know here in uh, the city the county it doesn't even matter we had an incident where there was someone you know oh God, I don't know if he was coming off of the side you know I think he was coming off from the side of to our left or he was trying to come from, he was going up the road, made a U-turn coming around. Instead of just hanging in the medium where you can kind of pace yourself and see what the traffic is doing, he completely did a U-E. In the middle of the road, mind you, we were going a good, there was no cars in front of us, no cars behind us. This fool, it looked like he almost did a 360 and like at 60 miles an hour, it was horrible. It was horrible. We had to pretty much almost like speed up, like the brake, then speed around to avoid him. And then he goes around us. We all end up at the red light. And then he stops and never even acknowledged, paid attention or nothing. As soon as we the, get the green light, he's flying. Boom jumps in front of us, a van jumps in front of him. It's crazy out here. I just want y'all to be super careful because these fools don't care. They are in their own world. And since this panorama has happened, it has just gotten worse. So you guys just stay safe out there and just, you know, pay attention to what's going on around you because they don't care. These drivers are out for self. They're trying to knock you out of the way as fast as they can without any remorse. You know, take no prisoners. They are just doing their own thing and not giving a darn because the police are not policing out here with these little petty situations that are going on with people and their bad driving. So 
just uh, keep your eyes open and, you know, take care of you. Be safe. I wanted to I wanted upload to... Uh, a nice little hello Saturday to see how you guys are doing. Leave me some comments down below and tell me how your uh, Saturday is going. And consider subscribing because um, it's a worthy channel to watch. I mean, we talk about life and relationships here. And I also have a podcast if you just like to listen to when I'm not ranting, but sometimes when I'm just chatting about how life is and things that go on and how our relationships are, you know, at this day and age, because they are very different than they used to be. So yeah, check out my podcast, Evolving with Etta, the podcast. It's, it's listen worthy. It's pretty good. Let me know what you think about it. But if you like any of the content that you currently see me uploading, just, you know, try one of my playlists. Try the relationships playlist, um, a little bit of information of narcissists that are on there. I mean, I kind of speak on uh, a lot, not uh, like politics and things like that. I'm not like that into stuff like that, but I do like to chat. So yeah. And you know, like I said, it could be, you know, something worth your while. If you're interested so, in any of the relationship content, try and check some of my uploads out and uh, let me know what you think. I am trying to reach 1 million subscribers. Will you help me get there? Are you interested in assisting me in growing my channel? If there's anything particular that you really like to see, or if there's something in particular that you like Howard and I to converse about, or my sister circle to chat about, leave me some comments and let me know exactly what it is that you might find watchworthy something that would be a great upload that you would be interested in watching. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.